crop insurance remains top of mind for growers as we push toward this harvest season. Brooks York with AgriSampo joins us now with some industry insight. Brooks, thank you so much for being here. So, you know, a lot of guys are wondering if they're going to be able to get that payout uh, as far as crop insurance. You're seeing that there is going to be some payout, but the question is, is it going to help them? Well, it, it is obviously going to help them. You know, Suzanne, the profitability is going to be challenging across the country, even in areas where there is a good crop because of this price decline. In the areas where we have had some yield loss combined with that price loss, um, indemnities are welcome. And unfortunately, it probably won't prop those folks up over a profitability line into the positive or into the black to say, but what it can do is it limits that loss. And when we think about these expenses that go into corn and soybeans, Every farm's different, but there's expense structures to an acre of corn that may be $800 to $1,100 an acre. That sounds extreme, but that's all in, and that's real. Uh, soybeans can be anywhere from $500 to $800 across the country, depending where we're at. And of course, that includes direct and indirect costs as well. There's a lot sunk into this crop. So what crop insurance does is it may not guarantee profits, but it limits those losses across the board. Boy, it is a big safety net that is so needed right now. Obviously, it is one of the biggest talking points when we're talking about this new farm bill. But Brooks, possibility of this getting extended. Any silver lining to see this farm bill kind of extended and waiting till 2025? Uh, what, what help is there for producers on, on safety nets here? You know, I think what it does is um, there may be a silver lining in this. The timing of a sell-off in the market combined with the need for this farm bill, when you put those two together, there's obviously some more urgency now than maybe there was months ago. And um, you can't help but think that, you know, crop insurance and its title could be bolstered here, at least stay the same. The, the crop insurance, the key is that, uh, you know, other disaster programs, they're welcomed on the farm. Um, you know, we won't turn those down, but sometimes they come maybe at the wrong time, maybe not at the right amount, uh, sometimes in the wrong geographies. Crop. Oh, I think we lost you, Brooks. Thank you so much. That is Brooks York, AgriSampo Producer Services Director, with some great information there. Of course, looking forward to making sure that this farm bill gets done. Of course, safety net, top priority.